Come on in. Good morning and welcome to Trans West Truck Trailer RV. This is Katie O'Neill and I am so excited about today's video. We have just gotten a swath of 2023 Numar Superstars in all sorts of shapes and sizes. But I've got one client in particular who's looking for, I think, exactly this model. So I can't wait to show it to you. And yes, this coach is available. Now, as usual, I like to start my RV videos from the inside out. So Jody, if you wouldn't mind, go ahead and take her on back. Uh, today is a great day. I'm gonna to go to the Botanic Gardens tonight with some clients who actually special ordered a superstar from me. Uh, and we're all going to go together for evening alfresca. So that is the reason for this uh, decadent outfit in this occasion. Uh, but this coach is also a decadent coach. So this is one of my favorite floor plans. Uh, so in 2023, when we came out with the 4059, uh, we really, really changed the market. Um, or I should say 2022. Uh, the 4051 was a great floor plan, but this bath and a half really boasts of some great things. One of them is right here, the separation of space from the toilet to the shower. And another nice feature about the shower here is that it's one of those square showers. It's not a radius shower. So it's a very easy to occupy very roomy shower and it still has this teak bench uh, although it is in the corner and that gives us a great ability to sit down you know wash your feet shave your legs all of those things that are so important because as you can imagine if you were trying to wash your feet and you were in a coach that didn't have its bench you wouldn't be able to actually sit down you'd have to sit on the floor of the of the shower so for those guys out there shopping for your wives this is something that will really seal the deal. It's a very, very nice feature to have. Uh, another nice feature is going to be our uh, shower miser water saving system. This is a great feature where you can actually turn your little uh, dial over here to recycle and it will recycle that water through. So your 105 gallons of hot water or of your fresh water will heat up and get nice and hot and also not fill your gray tank until you put it back over here into the actual shower. At that point, when it starts coming out of the faucet, it will go into your 65 gallon gray tank. But of course, it's so nice conserving that water if you're boondocking. Uh, another great feature is a great little shelf here. I mean, I have a 2022 Superstar and I use this to keep, you know, my shampoo, my razor, toothbrush, all of those things. And then I always like to mention that this is on a slide so you can adjust it. If you've had a long day hiking, you can bring the water nice down low, sit and relax. And then last but not least, we have this overhead skylight. And this is just a really nice feature to let a little bit of that natural light in in the morning when you're getting up and ready for your day. Now, another great feature in this 4059 is all of the medicine cabinet space. And I know we talk about this all the time, but these, these cabinets are manufactured by the Amish in Napanee, Indiana, where new Mars are made. And one of the things that you'll know about these cabinets is this is a very nice, solid coach. And as you're out there in the marketplace shopping, that's a really important feature. So there's so many coaches that look well, but this is built well. And I think that that's the most important feature of this RV. Um, I also like this little hide a cubby. So if you did have a longer outfit that you wanted to be able to have hanging, you could hang it into this corner space. Uh, but if you don't, you can fill that up with any type of supplies that you like. And then of course, to the left, you'll see we have our safe as well. And then all of these cubbies come with these nice LED lights. And one of the reasons I point this out is because as you shop in the marketplace, these are not standard features. These are things that really differentiate Numar from the rest. Another great feature that differentiates this coach from others is the fact that not only do we have big deep drawer space, we have small drawer space. So what is this good for? Imagine how many socks, bathing suits, cycling shorts, sets of underwear, you need all the things that you could possibly need to get store on your trip separated in a nice, small, deep pocketed drawers that have soft clothes. Uh, just really great place to keep all of your things. And then another great space here to keep all of your linen. So I know we struggle with where do you keep those beach towels? Where do you keep those uh, you know, hand cloths and washcloths? Great spot there. And then you still have your uh, drawers here for his and hers, all of your cosmetics, toothbrushes, dental floss, and the like. So. I just really think that this bathroom has got a great setup. Another nice feature about this coach in my uh, 4065 bunk model, we do our laundry 
two, three times a day if we have cycle clothes that we're washing. They do have some really uh, nice features. So for instance, you can go ahead and go to active wear. There's an actual active wear setting. Uh, if you've got jeans, you can wash your jeans. If you've got, you know, whites, you can do your whites. So this is a really nice washer and dryer. Uh, but in my uh, coach, if I'm trying to catch up to all my laundry in between locations, I have to open my slide to get to my dryer. So very nice to have this convenient location for your washer and dryer. And then I would highly encourage you to know that this is a lot of space down here. So another great place. We actually keep our sheets in here as well as a packet of Tide Pods and some dryer sheets. So great feature there. And for those of you that are wondering, yes, you can absolutely do your laundry while you're going down the road. Uh, another nice feature though is if you don't get your laundry done, go ahead and unlock this door, go ahead and open it up. And at the end of your camping trip, you can just drop your laundry out. Now, this also has a, a magnetic uh, cover right here with a ladder behind it that deploys. So if you needed to use this as an egress door, you could do that, but it's also just a great place to be able to take and unload your coach at the end of your trip. Uh, this coach also has a robe hook, unlike my 4065, which does not. Hey, Ken Williamson, I hope you heard that. I'm looking for that robe hook. Uh, the fantastic fan, uh, this is a water sensing fan, a rain sensing fan, but one of the things that's really nice about this is a lot of times I'll keep this on at night and uh, keep it open on a very low speed just to pull that fresh air uh, through the coach, through the bedroom windows that are on either side of my headboard, giving me that nice smell that we like to enjoy when we're out camping. Uh, so here's that headboard. Now I want to make mention of this. Uh, this is the end of an era. So this has been our motif. I call it the Fendi insert, right? Because you can take them off and clean them. But this has been our motif since this coach debuted in 2020. And in 2024, which we've got ordered right now and in production, this motif goes away. So if you like this look, um, someone said to me earlier uh, this week, they felt like it was kind of like a Mandarin look. And I do agree. Um, even with your decorative ceiling inserts that are hiding all of your air conditioner ducts and returns, uh, this is a really, really beautiful uh, decorative look. And this is going to be changed into more of a Romanesque or pillar type of pattern with some integrated uh, chrome, some fancier vessel sinks. Uh, so if you like this simple sink look, this simple um, you know, wood finish, uh, this is something you wanna take advantage of this. I think we have seven superstars here in inventory currently. So if you're looking for a superstar, we ordered as many as we could get our hands on for 2023. Uh, with the chassis update, there's going to be a pretty significant price increase. Um, and if you'd like to talk about the benefits and disadvantages of those things, I would be more than happy to discuss both. You can also check out my 2024 Superstar video uh, by just typing in 2024 Superstar into the YouTube search bar. I did a few videos when we were at the dealer meeting earlier in April. Uh, so again, we talked a little bit earlier about these windows and that fresh air that you get, that cross ventilation. Another feature of this coach that I like is the headboard. Uh, starting in 2021, they moved uh, to an all lights off switch here above in that KOB panel. You also have the upgraded security light system on this coach and you can operate all of those lights here. But in 2023, we did a lot of really big modifications and one of those modifications is in the under the walls, what you can't see. And what we did is we took that uh, silver leaf system with a KIB panel switch and we actually gave you Wi-Fi connectivity so you can operate an app on your phone. So not only can you control all of your lights here at the headboard of the coach, you can control them on their phone. So as opposed to having to turn everything off all at once, you can turn on or off one light at a time or a group of lights. And I'll show you how that works as well because they also added a 10 inch integrated panel onto the center of the coach, giving you much better connectivity. So here's one of your hanging wardrobes. And then down below we have our media cabinet great place to keep a PlayStation. Uh, it's all HDMI wired. And then here's those drawers we were talking about. So some big deep pocket drawers. These are a little more narrow, but still big. And then I really like the fact that Numar gives you full access to this drawer, even though it's located under the wardrobe by allowing it to hyper extend out past this wardrobe as well. So all of these solid maple cabinets um, are in the Newport glazed maple finish. And this is the matte finish. Uh, this is a really nice look. 
And then as you can see, the Lambrequins have a very simple inlay, so this is not an overtly a decorated cabin. Uh, you're not going to have to try to match it to paisley patterns or anything like that. You can really come in here and uh, add to your own decor. Now this is going to be the Newport glazed uh, maple uh, matte finish with the Gotham interior and the Gotham exterior. Now please note in 2022, Gotham exterior was green and gold. Gotham exterior in 2023 is white and blue and it is gorgeous. Um, so here's your 43 inch smart TV. Uh, what's nice about this smart TV is everything these days seems to be coming off of an app, whether it's Netflix, Hulu, Apple TV. Um, I have a client that came in um, off of a video, actually, they're purchasing a, a Ventana from us later on this week. And he's like, oh man, I, I, how do I get my Apple TV to display on both places? I only have one module. And I was like, dude, you just log in. These TVs are all ready to go. So it really streamlines your watching process. Uh, so please note, this coach has just about every single option available on it. Um, it has the, the security package, the washer and dryer, central vac. It has the chrome uh, power door locks as well as the chrome trim. It has the buddy plug. I mean, it really has just about everything, a 360 overhead camera. Uh, but the one thing it doesn't have is a satellite system because we don't know how you want to do satellite. And we also don't have our Wi-Fi system integrated here because for some of you, you'd prefer Starlink while others might want to have something that's cellular based like Cradle Point. So all of those things can be added for a very similar price point to what you'd find at the manufacturer level. And they can actually be a lot better than what's offered by the manufacturer because you can get a coach that doesn't come with a dish network or a direct TV satellite. It comes with a satellite that operates the way you like it. And our installation cost, including parts and labor is going to be very similar to that of the factory, but you get to pick and choose. Uh, so if you do decide to buy this coach, please let me know. Um, another nice feature of this of this coach is going to be all of these solid wood pocket doors. So not only do you have a pocket door here, but you also have a pocket door here separating your bathroom from your uh, from your uh, your from your bedroom. Thank you. <laughs> and so what's nice about this is you can have somebody up here getting ready in the morning while you're sleeping in. Or you could have somebody in the front making breakfast, making coffee while you're sleeping in. Or you could have both. You could have your husband up and getting ready so he looks nice, your kids making you breakfast. And then of course that treatment of just being the queen laying in bed and waiting for everyone to bring you French toast. Uh, so on either side of your nightstands, you will have two USB ports as well as 110 outlets. And this is a nice little place to keep any kind of lotion or uh, books that you might want to keep your uh, water bottle going down the road if you've got a water bottle that you like to keep next to your bed and then underneath here you'll see that we have two uh, chairs as well as two extensions for this table now these are 11 inch wide extensions so in other words the table i'm going to show you can go out 22 inches further and these are the two chairs but i also want to show you the pockets on the left and the right hand side of this coach because there's a few things going on here. Not only could you use it for a CPAP machine or storage, but you'll notice that there's space above on either side to tuck in your uh, blankets, to tuck in your, um, your comforter. And then down here on the left, you'll see one of these hydronic heat vents and also that courtesy light. One of the things I really like about this uh, Numar is the lighting option. So I have a very similar coach. Mine, of course, is a bunk model but I really like to have this uh, really nice ambient lighting that you get here. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you how that looks. Uh, let me go ahead and turn this off real quick. So bedroom master, all lights off. And then I'm just gonna turn on the accent light. So you can see this really nice soft accent light is great when you're going to bed at night and you don't wanna have too much light in the room. You could also just turn on one of the reading lights if you wanted to catch up on a book. And then the other thing I think that's really nice is that you can actually just turn on only these courtesy lights. So if you see down here, you've got these great little puddle lights that are going to show you the way at night so that you can see what you're doing. So really nice feature of a higher end coach, of course, is going to be to have better lighting available to you. And one of the things that gives you the, the control of that is going to be this new 10 inch panel for 2023. So this is a big upgrade between 22 and 23. As you can see here, I can go ahead and just go ahead and hit all lights on and all of my lights will go on, or I can turn in my individual lights. The other thing I have available to me here is a home screen, which shows me where my batteries are. It shows me uh, what my tank 
uh, heat is. It shows me um, if I if I want to turn on my water pump, I can do all of that right here. Uh, you can also go here to AGS and see that your generator is running, um, it, how long it's been running. You can control your HVAC here, uh, so all of your climate control. And then this is that app I told you you could pair to as well as lighting. So really nice features here. Now below this we've got another uh, control panel for your fantastic fan. This is the kitchen fan. So if you are cooking inside of your coach, great feature that you can get that uh, exhaust fan going. And then down below here next to our courtesy light, you'll see that we have our central vac. Uh, this is another nice feature. My central vac is in my mid bath on the, on the bunk model. So I do like that placement a little bit better. And then here is this fantastic half bath. Now, what does this do for you? And of course we all know what the answer is. This gives you that ability to have company over and to have privacy where you've got somewhere where someone can come in, they can use the facilities and they're not going to be entering into your bedroom. They're actually going to be able to have access to their own room. And Jody, if you wouldn't mind to step towards the front of the coach and back up, that way I can show everyone how roomy this looks. When you're here and you have company, it doesn't feel claustrophobic. It doesn't feel closed in. It feels really open, but you can also see You've got this great wall of privacy here where if you haven't made your bed, maybe you've got some socks and shoes that are strewn about on the floor, you just haven't had enough time to tidy up, just slide that door closed and if someone needs to use the restroom, they still have access to it. And now that we've got a little extra room here, I'm gonna open these doors and then just step aside again so that you can see all of this room. So there's a ton of room here for storage. And then as you can see in the center here, right below the third fantastic fan, you also have your breaker panel as well as some extra fuses. So very, very tidy, very well labeled, well laid out, uh, great access. Um, and so this is something that Numar is really, really good at. Um, and all of this storage is just giving you so much more room um, to store things. Like for me, if I had this extra space here, this would be a great place to keep just kitchen towels hand towels, things along those lines, maybe some supplies that I'm gonna be using that is right near the kitchen. Now, speaking of this kitchen, we use this Whirlpool refrigerator in a number of our models because it is such a nice refrigerator. All of the room, you've got a water dispenser on the door. You've got this nice table, ta or this nice tray that slides out of the way. So if you've got bottles of Prosecco, orange juice, and they don't fit here in your pockets, um, then you have another place you could store them. Now these are really deep pockets, which is great. So if you've got gallons of milk, uh, anything along those lines, and then also you have a really nice veggie drawer as well. Veggie drawer, cheese and meat drawer. Jody, cheese and meat drawer, what am I thinking? Oh, look at all the ice melted. Someone left the ice maker on. So this does have an ice maker. Uh, this coach was unplugged and warm, warm, warm this morning. Right now we are running uh, one, we are running both of our 15,000 BTU air conditioners off of our eight kilowatt, eight kilowatt generator. So specs on this coach, 100 gallon fuel capacity, 150 gallons of fresh water, 65 gallons of gray water, 40 gallons of, uh, of black water, sorry, 60 gallons of gray water, 40 gallons of black water. Um, and, and also, uh, as I mentioned earlier, dual loop Oasis system for hydronic heat, so no propane on board. This is a really, really nice feature of this coach. And I think I mentioned 105 gallons earlier. We have 105 gallons across the board on any of our larger coaches, uh, but when you get into the Super C class, it's very uh, standard in this uh, segment to have 150 gallons of fresh water. And that is a really huge benefit to you if you wanna be out on the open road, not at a campsite a little bit longer. Another huge benefit is not being uh, relegated to needing propane uh, because you can run off of your diesel tanks. So here's our clipboard on, or our cutting board on the back of these uh, stove covers. One thing I think is really fantastic, I spent a lot of time last week actually making French toast and bacon outside on our picnic table. Uh, while I had this out of the pocket, I was able to go ahead and put my covers back on place so I didn't lose any of my cutting space. I had all of this great prep space. And then on top of it, I was able to use this as a drying rack. So instead of having to have all of my dishes up on the countertop, I was able to actually keep them here to stow. And then we have our 
uh, silverware drawer here. And then in my coach, this is full of additional cutting boards, um, you know, knives, things like that. And then I keep all of our spatulas and tongs and bottle openers here in all of these drawers. So great kitchen space, really nice, wide, deep storage. So plenty of room. And then up here, I keep my balsamic vinegar, oil, uh, and any of the cooking supplies that I need here for the stove. And then up here, we keep pots and pans. And I keep all of my dishware under the seats, but I'll show that to you in a minute. Uh, so this convection and microwave oven is really large. Uh, this is going to give you enough room to not only make a chicken, but you could bake a turkey in this. If you didn't feel like baking a turkey, you could just microwave a burrito, whatever suits your fancy. But we all know that a great microwave is no benefit if you don't have great ingredient storage. Take a look at this pantry. This is so decadent. You actually have seven drawers that are full extension. This is one of the best features of the 4059. You have so much pantry space, so much kitchen space, and a bath and a half. Love that aspect of this coach. Um, I would say the downside of this coach is right here. This is a small trash can. Uh, what I did is I actually took a larger trash can and I cut it off at the top and made it as tall as I could. And then I used that in the bathroom. <laughs> so um, I love the scrubby drawer. If you're trying to conserve water, this is the best sink out there on the market. It's a dual basin stainless steel sink. So you put all of your sudsy water in here, your rinse water over here, and you can really get a lot of dishes done. And then of course, as we mentioned earlier, you just put them over in the dishwasher as more of a drying rack. Uh, we'll run our dishwasher two or three times during a camping trip, but for the most part, we'll actually be using our dishwasher as a drying rack most of the time. Oh, a little extra counter space if you need it. And then down here, just more access if you wanna to get to cleaning supplies like Clorox wipes or anything like that to clean up after dinner. Uh, so as you can see, this has the theater seat uh, option. This is a really highly desired feature in this coach. Uh, so these two suites do swivel and turn around. They are air rides, so you can bring them up so that the population in your coach could be at the same level as you, uh, but they are not recliners like you would have in a class A. So having recliners, oops, let me do it, there we go, is uh, if you're looking for recliners is really important because in a super C like this, this is the only way to get the recliners. And here, I'm gonna put this all the way down because people always ask if you could sleep here. And I think you could certainly sleep here. Um, this is very comfortable. Uh, and then of course, this comes paired with uh, not only your two theater seats, but also we know the rules, right? It's six for drinks, four for dinner, and two to sleep. So you've got your two, but if you did wanna have your four for dinner, as I mentioned earlier, a 22 inch extension here available with your extra four chairs and what's really nice about this setup is when you have your six for drinks these two chairs the way that they're designed uh, if you have the convertible dinette which is the one that turns into a bed this is more of a square setting and what it does is it makes the bench a little bit wider this is a really comfortable bench for two people i would say it would be a little bit tight for uh, four people but if you have two people sitting here, two up here, and then two in your theater seats, all six of you could be very comfortably sitting around the coach, you know, jibber jabbering about all of the day's events, the kids, whatever it's done recently in your life that you want to talk about. This is a very, very comfortable hangout space in your RV. Um, now, when you're not hanging out with your friends and you want to watch television, we have a beautiful 50 inch uh, 4K smart TV, which I'll put up on the televator. You'll note that there are 110 outlets and USB ports on either side of this TV as well. All of these open, all these windows open around the coach, so you've got lots of fresh air coming through. Great place to store some parcheesi, backgammon, um, any you know cribbage sets. If you play bridge, you can keep all your cards up there. Another great place here if you want to have a video game for the grands that are coming to visit. Totally got tons of room there. And then another great cubby here. And I just opened these up because I think it's really important to understand that there is uh, electronics and wiring underneath behind these. But look at what a great job Numar does with this beautiful, very uh, solid, very hardy cabinetry. So we love that feature. And then there's even more over here. Now you could certainly keep your 
dishes here if you wanted to. Um, but I would use this because the bins are so deep and there's so much storage up here, probably for other storage. And I would probably keep my dishes, at least I do, uh, underneath here. So I love being able to stack all of my plates, all of my bowls underneath. And then whenever we get to where we're camping, we'll pull out two bowls, two plates, um, two coffee cups, and then the silverware. And we'll keep everything in the dishwasher until it's time to head down the road. And then when it's time to head down the road, I just put it back underneath in the cubbies. And then the other one I use, oh, there we go. Um, I use for my placemats and my napkins. So however you want to set it up, but that's how we use ours. Um, again, all of these remove so they're easy to clean, keep your coach looking fresh. And then also up here, you'll see we have a very, very tidy, uh, tidy bay here. So this is your house uh, disconnect. So we know the house is on right now. Entry lock, right? To lock and unlock your doors. This is to unlock and lock your, uh, your storage bays. You can do this from outside of the coach on the keypad. You could do it from your keys. You could also do it here though. And this is a really, really nice feature because if you wanna get set up for camping, you just get to wherever you're going. These will lock automatically when you turn the coach on and put it in drive and start moving forward. But when you arrive at your destination, you just hit one button and everything's unlocked. Um, another nice feature, if you do have the grandkids with you, of course they would have to sleep on like an inflatable mattress here, but look at all of this uh, floor area that's covered all the way up to the door. The other thing of course that could be useful for is if you have a small dog or a large dog going down the road with you. Uh, so great step cover. Uh, your block heater, um, I'll tell you, if you don't use your block heater and it's really cold, you'll probably get a fault code. And when uh, Renegade, or not Renegade, when uh, Freightliner clears it, they'll probably charge you $167 to clear the fault code that you could have avoided by having your block heater on before you started your engine. Um, this M HWH Master Reset, hold for five seconds. What that is pertaining to is your leveling jacks and your steps. If you're having a hard time with them, this is your first line of defense. But we have had a great partnership with HWH for over 30 years. Uh, they are very familiar with the Numar product. And as you can see now, this little yellow light's just telling you that this coach is nosing forward, so it's almost leaning completely forward. If it was leaning to the side, you'd see these other lights illuminated, or to the back, you'd see this one illuminated. One of the things that's nice about this coach is when you hit auto level, it actually will dump your rear airbags so you don't hyperextend your front airbag. So really, really smart leveling system. No other buttons to, you can either hit auto level or auto store. Those are the only two buttons you need to know about. Uh, now here we'll see we've got our Gerard awnings deployed today. So these are also available by remote and there's a controller for it outside as well. Uh, you've got your Magnum, uh, your Magnum uh, energy system up here where you can read everything. But like I said, a lot of this is going to be available on your phone now. So you probably won't spend much time up here looking at your power control systems. If you want to geek out, you can. Uh, this is gonna be your slide control. So we're gonna go ahead and bring these slides in right now. So you can see how these work. These are electric slides. If you'd like to get into a hydronic slide that has the, our hydraulic slide that has the ability to have an all tile floor, you would have to move up into our Supreme Air. Our Supreme Air has all tile, but as you can see here, there's very little carpet in this uh, Superstar. So although there's carpeted slides because they're electric, there's not a lot of carpet, which I think is really nice. Now, another thing I wanted to point out, and Jody can show you if he just steps back a little bit, on the outside of these slides, you'll see that they're color matched to match the coach. So this is a really cool feature. You know you're in a higher end RV when you see these slides pop out and they're not just plain white. Um, this is part of our masterpiece finish. I've got to tell you, one of the nicest things about this RV uh, is I love the way the Gotham came out for 2023. So this is a no charge color option. Um, it's beautiful. Uh, but one thing I will say is it's really cool if you decide that you want to have a coach that matches your race car stacker. If you want to have a coach that matches your, 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 school, your kid's school or maybe your alma mater, whatever it may be that you'd like to have it match, you can call me. We can order an RV for you and you get to choose a skin A, B, and C and you can have your own custom colored RV. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and bring this rear slide in, but now that we have it in, as you can see here, I have plenty of space here. So if you do have a big dog and you have this slide, uh, this step covered, not only can you get back and forth to use the restroom, but you could also have a big pooch right here in the middle. And then again, 
total access to your center bath. Uh, plenty of room. And I am going to bring this for this other slide in. So the 4059 has really been a fantastic uh, selling coach for us. Uh, a lot of people have different preferences for wood colors, for leather colors, uh, for, you know, even the Lambrequins, like the color of the fabric on the insert, in, you know, with the wood. One of the nicest aspects of Numar is that we have multiple wood colors to choose from. We have multiple interior colors to choose from, and you can really customize and make this coach exactly what you want. But if you're going to customize a coach now, you are going to be moving into that 2024. So let's talk a little bit about what you're getting in 2023. So here in 2023, you'll notice that we have a lot of buttons throughout this dash. In 2024, they're just moved over here. Um, there are some things that are integrated that are different, but a lot of it for the most part is very similar to what you see here. The M2106 chassis though does have an integrated change where they're going to have the mobile eye, so that lane tracking package, and then your adaptive cruise control. So if those are some things that you think you would use, I would encourage you to look at the video for 2024 and for 2023. Now I'm gonna tell you, we have this engine running now. This is as loud as it gets. So if you're like, wow, I don't really hear the engine that much. That's right, we are running both the generator and the engine to this coach right now. And it's really not very loud. But I will tell you that this coach does not have comfort drive. This is a semi truck. So this is a hands on drive. Um, I drive my coach all over the place. If you would like to talk to me a little bit about, you know, the engine brake and how that works. Uh, it's a dual stage engine brake, uh, you know, on and off. Um, you know, if you want to talk about being able to change your transmission settings in your Allison transmission so that you're at a particular gear, all of those things I can help you with. But the one thing I'll say is a lot of the upgrades in the chassis that you see for 2024 with Freightliner are, ch are chassis changes that are necessary to be competitive with people who have, um, you know, lane tracking packages, adaptive cruise control on their cars. I don't think I would use adaptive cruise control very frequently on this coach. I feel very much inclined to have one foot either on the brake or on the accelerator, depending on which way I'm going up or down the hill. And I definitely feel like it's really important for me to have my eyes on the road. So I don't think I would be using the um, lane tracking package. It makes a lot of noise. I would probably be turning it off. So just in all honesty. Um, okay. so. I'm gonna go ahead and accept here. One of the things that doesn't change from this year to next year is going to be this. And what I think is really important is you have this fantastic camera system where you could actually see over the top of your coach. So if you wanna hit that picnic table on purpose, no problem, just go ahead and aim. Um, so this is a really nice feature of this coach that you have all of this great um, connectivity. So. Uh, you can uh, use your camera system, you can operate your media, you've got Sirius satellite radio, Bluetooth can be for your maps if you want to run Google Maps. Uh, and then in 2023, you can also display Apple CarPlay on this dash. So this coach is equipped with Apple CarPlay, not in 2024, but in 2023. And I do think that that's a really big upgrade and a really big advantage for a lot of people. Now we still have our cruise control, right? So all of that's here. We have our lights uh, as well. Um, we've got our, our turn signal as well as our, um, our windshield wipers. Very uh, simple, very clear dash, very similar in 24 when you watch that video. Um, and the climate control systems are also very similar. So like I said, tune into that video, make sure that it's worth it for you to spend that extra dough because in my estimation, I think a 2023 with all of the infrastructure upgrades that have been given to this coach, uh, in terms of the operational and connectivity, in terms of having Apple CarPlay, they're already on this RV. So I like this RV a lot, the way it sits. Um, also, you'll see that we have our air ride seats, as I mentioned earlier. And then there's also pneumatic lumbar here and then heated seats down here as well. So all of those controls. And I think that I'm gonna meet you outside, Jody, if that's okay. I'm gonna come around to that door.
So one of the features that I want to talk about with this RV is the fact that you've got really easy access to your engine. So this is important for a lot of people. And honestly, these are very, very reliable coaches. As you can see here, your 8.9 liter Cummins engine married here to your Freightliner uh, chassis. Uh, easy access to windshield wiping flu wiper fluid, easy access to your air filters. Also, as you come around here, easy access to your, uh, your fuel filter and water separator, and then also your jump points for your battery. Um, so this is a really nice cab in that regards that everything is very easy to access, but this is a lot of living space. So for those of you that haven't compared a Class A to a Super C, I'd drive both. I'd walk both, I'd sit in both, and I would just discover which one you think will fit you because they're not, um, I have a lot of people that come in looking for a Super C that might discover that they actually like a Class A. And then I have a lot of people who come in looking for a Class A that discover that they just love a Super C. So make sure you're trying these things on. This isn't COVID anymore. We have inventory. We have very good professionals test driving, kicking tires, coming out to visit us, driving these coaches. All of that's free. Um, what's not free is making the wrong decision and having to come back in and buy again. So please do your research. Come out. I've got a client coming out uh, from Vegas next week to test drive Class A's versus Super C's. I've got a client coming in this week to pick up a Ventana that did the same thing. I just delivered a custom ordered Superstar. So I would love to be able to help you make the right decision for your family. Now we will talk about some things that are really nice about this. Like this is a really nice uh, bumper and I know that looks, oh, it's just shiny. No, it's a three piece bumper. So if you have a little oopsie, you can just repair one portion of it, not the whole thing. Another nice feature of it is again, that surround camera. So there's your front camera, right? And then you've got your side cameras here so that when you are making a lane change, you can see to the left and right of you, but that's just part of your camera system. So you have four cameras surrounding the coach and then two on the side. So this is gonna give you a total of six cameras, giving you really good avail availability of seeing what you're doing. Now, another thing that people really like about this coach, this is where your 100 gallon fuel tank is. So you've got access to your saddle tanks. There's two 50 gallon saddle tanks. Uh, you would fill those ideally uh, at the same time. If you wait for that bleed over, it's gonna take quite a while. You can fill them at the same time at any of those drive-through uh, truck stops. I mean, we stop at them all the time and typically we'll stop whenever we think we're down about three quarters of a tank, just top it off. And then always before we get to anywhere we're boondocking because if you don't have enough diesel, your hydronic system and your generator will not function. This coach will not leave you stranded. It would prefer to have you be cold over having you stuck. Um, okay, so as you can see here, all of these great features. So there's handles here, there's a handle here, there's a handle here, there's a handle here. So for any of you that have mobility issues, this is a very easy coach to get into. Uh, so that's a great feature. Um, now up here in the front, you'll see we have something that makes this very different than all of the other coaches. This is your little button right here for your air ride cab. Now what that means is as you're going down the road, this cab, as you can see, is floating. So this air ride cab is not connected. So when you see a semi truck that's pulling a big heavy payload, it's also separate, right? Well, the reason that you have this is because all of your air ride features in this coach allow you to feel like you're hovering down the road while the rest of the coach is moving around you. Um, and that's why you see semi trucks uh, constructed that way. Now keep in mind, when you're parked, you want to turn this off. Uh, there's no problem with it being on, but it does make noise. And if it loses air at like three o'clock in the morning, it might come on and really startle you. So just make sure you turn that off when you park. Uh, so this air shock you can use from the front uh, fuel area. There's a little valve in there where you can plug this in. You could air up all of your tires. As you can see, a lot of storage room here. Um, this of course is given to us with our star foundation. Another nice feature of HWH is this hydraulic step. So this is a really cool step. This is not available. For instance, this coach in a super C is a superstar. This coach in a class A is a Ventana. The Ventana does not get this step. Uh, this step because of the way that the RV is constructed is necessary. Uh, but this is something that you normally only get to at the London air level. So it's a really nice step. Another nice feature of this coach, of course, is the fact that you've got a screen door that you can hand things through here. And then this nice solid door as well. 
Everything is gonna slide in. Again, color matched the whole way through. You have your key code here to lock and unlock not only your door, but also all of your bays, as well as a doorbell so that if someone's coming to visit you, they don't have to you know, bang on your door. Um, so take a look at all of the storage in here. This is such a huge amount of storage. Now, as you'll see, we have like little LED lights up here in the corner. We have our uh, vacuum hose attachment for our central vac. So most of the time we can use that quick plate to sweep into, but when we're not sweeping into our kick plate, if we want to vacuum our rug, we have a nice little hose attachment as well. Oh, and see this? So I know Brian ordered this coach because Brian Moritz loves stainless steel trim as well as the uh, power door locks. So this has both of those options. Um, and then another 4K 43 inch smart TV. And if you want to listen to the Giants game up front or outside, you can run this to your sound bar. So you have a sound bar in the coach giving you surround sound for your movies as well as one outside. Uh, this is a great little thing to listen to. Uh, we took the kids to the Red Hot Chili Peppers. We sat out here, watched videos, tailgated before the show. It was super fun. Uh, this is one of those lights that we have that's part of that optional security light system. Anytime you can have illumination on your coach outside, it's really going to benefit you. And speaking of illumination, take a look at these Nova awnings. These Nova awnings are so nice. They have integrated lights uh, in the edge right here, so providing you a nice outdoor living room. They also have an elbow, so they tilt down, giving you a little more sun protection. And then on top of that, you'll note that we have here the carefree awning package. Now, I forgot to put them out, so I apologize, but there's one here, one on the other side, and one over the bath, one over the bedroom window. Um, what's nice about these, these awnings have, of course, a bounce sensor, so it's not a wind sensor. It's not like, it's not feeling how fast the wind is. It's whether or not that awning's popping up and down, and if it starts to, it'll go back in. These, on the other hand, are definitely a little more sturdy. Uh, so if you're in a breezy day, but you want to keep the sun out from the inside of the coach, this carefree awning package is fantastic. I can't speak highly enough of it. Now you'll note here in the back, we've got these beautiful Alcoa rims. And these are like no joke, like this is a lot of aluminum. These are big, heavy duty rims. And the reason you want to have a really nice aluminum rim is because it's going to lower the reverberation so that shaking and also it's going to give you a quieter ride going down the road. Now in this bay here, we can actually see our star foundation. So this is the only optional slide tray, but over here on the left, underneath the central vac system, you can see right here, this star foundation is taking the heavy weight of the exterior slides and it's pushing it down towards the center chassis rail. And what that's doing is it's giving you a lower, uh, a lower center of gravity and a better drive going down the road. Also, you'll see here we have some exterior awning controls. Maybe if I push the button the right way. Huh. Oh no, I turned the generator off, that won't go, no power, sorry. Uh, but anyway, so you could turn them, you could open and close your awnings here. You could also use your remote or you can do it from inside. And that's a really nice feature, especially if you're plugged into 50 amp and you're camping and then you have a storm roll through, just come over here, tap these real quick as opposed to going inside and searching for that remote. Um, extra floor tile here. We do have porcelain tile wood floors. Um, now, one thing to mention about this uh, tile floor is in 2024, if you want heated tile floors, you can get heated floors on the Superstar. So uh, for those of you who don't feel it's necessary, no big deal. But for those of you that have been asking for that option, we did hear you and we did bring that into the 2024 model. So again, great pass-through storage here to the back. So if you've got anything long, like fishing, uh, fishing poles, anything along that line, you can use that. The other thing that you could do though, is you could use this. So I love this. So I have a little Costco table that we keep here underneath. And then Jason has, I know you guys, he's really boring. We're not using it for top shelf and mixers. He has extension cords, tire shine, all those things, hydronic fluid. So if you tell people, if you watch this video, when you tell me, when you come in and buy your coach that you watch my video, when I sell you that coach, I'll give you a bottle of Oasis juice. You really want to have Oasis juice while you're on the road and it fits really well right up here. So um, I love, this is a huge feature, huge benefit only found on the Superstar as well. And then right below this, you'll see we've got our three inch, uh, this is a 20,000 pound tow hitch. We're also pre-wired here for your um, stagger and also for your seven pin connector. And 
Uh, again, 20,000 pound tow package, 1,150 foot pounds of torque. We've got a 360 horsepower engine. Here's the other side of that uh, pass through. And then right up here, you've got the optional uh, three pong extension. So this little buddy plug here is for your stacker trailer. Or if you just have something else that you want to run or charge outside of your coach, you can do that. Uh, these adapters come standard. So as you can see, you've got a, a reversible ball hitch as well as a downsizer. And as a standard option on this coach, if you buy a used coach, a lot of times those things aren't there. <laughs> saying. They disappear, it's so weird, whoa. Um, so let's talk about tank storage. So one of the things that's different on a Supreme Air versus a Superstar, as you'll see here, I really like this water bay. This water bay is solid. You can keep your hose here. If you get a, t a 20 foot gorilla hose, keep 10 there, keep the other 10 that you're not using as frequently here. And then your black water hose is really nice and conveniently located back here towards the rear of the coach, which is where usually your sewer system is going to be. Again, party in the front, business in the back, great location here. Um, of course, more of our LED lights, but this is a great place to keep also a box of gloves. Uh, you've got your whole house water, uh, water filter here, as well as an outdoor hot and cold water spigot, not just cold and then a power retracting water reel as well. And then another one of those carefree awnings. So great, great uh, sewer bay right there. Here's that eight kilowatt quiet diesel generator. Now you'll notice that I turned this off, but I can start it here. I can start it inside. Very easy access uh, to get into my Cummins generator. And of course this is powering my two 15, thousand BTU air conditioners as well as the rest of my coach now I have in this coach you can see eight uh, eight uh, batteries these eight batteries are not being powered currently by solar this coach is solar prepped now what does that mean I think that solar is a really great idea keep in mind all solar does is fill up your battery storage these lead acid batteries have 100 amp hours each so that's 800 amp hours of lead acid battery storage if you were to get the upgraded lithium ion package on the mountain air for instance or on the supreme air you would have 640 amp hours so less storage than you have here in these lead acid batteries um, if you were to pay for that extra battery you could get up to 960 amp hours but keep in mind at that point in time when you've got up to 960 amp hours of battery storage and a second inverter so that you can run one air conditioner going down the road, you've spent over $30,000 extra. So call me, talk to me about this. I've chosen to go with this option. I have not replaced my batteries. I've got some clients that have asked us to put AGMs in here. I'm happy to do that for you. Um, but honestly, I haven't had any issues. Uh, we live in Colorado, it freezes here, it gets hot here. These are very easy to use and they're also very inexpensive to replace. So. Keep that in mind, um, power on coaches is a big deal. And there are places where you absolutely want to have lithium ion. Uh, it's just not for everybody. And I think it's important to understand it's worth the dialogue to make sure you're spending money where you should. Uh, so here's our hydraulic pump. This is again that HWH leveling system and your hydraulic step are being powered by this uh, apparatus right here. And then to the left of it is our dual loop Oasis Chinook system. This dual loop system is going to give you a great amount of uh, heat for your water and then also hydronic heat. So when we talk about hydronic heat, it's not in the floor, it's in a tube and there's two, there's two tubes here. So heating loop two supply, heating loop one supply. So these two loops have a reservoir full of hydronic fluid. That's that Oasis juice I mentioned in this coach that's pumping underneath your coach, giving you thermostatically controllable bays as well as really nice quiet heat, not heat pumps. So quiet heat that's available at lower temperatures. So this is a much more all season coach than the majority of the coaches that you'll see. Now here you'll see that we have a 50 foot power cord on a power reel. We also have the optional surge protector on the bottom left hand corner there. We do have our cable supply as well. And then over here in the top, Next to another one of our security lights is another overhead camera giving us our surround camera. And then here we have another one of our carefree awnings. So that carefree awning package is inexpensive and it gives you three total awnings. 
And then again, access here to the front of your coach is very, very easy. This is your other fuel station, and it's also where you would access your air supply. Um, but plenty of room, um, heated seats on both sides, air ride on both sides, uh, everything that you need. And then your chassis disconnect is right here under the seat. So you've got a chassis disconnect in the front, house disconnect in the center, chrome convex mirrors here, as well as an antenna for your CB. And then, of course, this is how you release and attach the hood. Today we are looking at 5N230478. Again, 5N230478. And I'm gonna grab my clipboard so I can get you my phone number. Now, I know a lot of people tune into these videos uh, all week long, every, uh, every day, looking at the various coaches that we have to offer. But please keep in mind that these are live videos, so you're always welcome to chime in with any questions that you might have. You're also able to put in the comments below things that you'd like us to cover in the future. And we're more than happy to actually address, you know, singular questions for you specifically in our videos. And in fact, as I mentioned earlier, today's video is made specifically for a client. Uh, if you'd like me to make a video for you, just give me a call, should be a text. I'm at 303-562-8659. Again, 303-562-8659. My name is Katie O'Neill. I make these videos for you so I can get you out there on the road camping.